Hello there, my amazing, wonderful, beautiful YouTubers. This is Rainbow Heart. Depending upon where you live upon this amazing, wonderful, beautiful planet that we all live upon. Good morning, good afternoon, good evening. <laughs> Today I'm coming at you with a wonderful unboxing video. I am unboxing a Xbox Series S. It is the Fortnite and Rocket League edition. Ooh, it's got 512 gigabyte SSD. Yes, boy. <laughs> so, how about we get this little showboat on the rowboat and start unboxing? Ooh, this tape is on there real good. Ooh. Ooh, must be careful. Cannot afford to tear any of this. Ooh, careful, 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 careful. Whew. Okay. Ooh. Ooh, I did not see that there was tape up there, too. <laughs> oh, dear, oh, dear, oh, dear. So, yeah, let's carefully untape this, too. Oh. This is stuck on there real good. Oh. Yep. I knew that was going to happen. Oh, Jesus. So a little bit of it got torn. Yeah, because that's something that I wanted to have happen. But it's not so much the box that you got to really worry about. It's really the actual console in and of its own self. Let's push you back out here. Now, let's see how... Man, they really don't want you getting into this thing, do they? worse they end up making it to wear. Uh, it gets stuck on there so good that you've got no choice but to tear at the box. Man, Microsoft I'm sorry, but you replaced me as the tape person. There are so many little things of tape on here. And of course, the box is also going to get torn because of it. So, this is a real passion pill. How to unbox this. All this tape. Ooh, thick cardboard up at the top. Nice crate. Is this really what it looks like? It's tiny. I am underwhelmed here, people. I am very underwhelmed. I thought that this thing was going to be like this big old bulk and behemoth, and look, this is very small. So let's put this off to the side, and let's carefully get this out. I will admit that the Fortnite Edition one does look pretty nice. This thing's hefty. Hmm. Ah, check this out, you guys. Right on the back here, there's your storage uh, expansion there. There's your little power cord, HDMI cable, SS 
SS, and then your Ethernet cable. Do like jump drives. So if you got any saves, you put them back there. It's got a little button here in the front. A little jump drive thingy for the front too. I have not hooked this bad boy up quite yet to a TV, which I will do like later and I will give it a test run. Maybe not a good idea to actually do that. I'll take that part out. There we go. Ah. Yeah, like I said, Ethernet cable cord, the USBs, HDMIs, storage expansion, and then the power. Okie doke. So, let's take a look back here. So this is the HDMI cable cord that you get with it, which is nice. It's already right there, so I could just plug that in and then plug it into the TV. And here's the power, as you can see. So you can hook this bad boy up. Of course, the instructional manual on how to use it, navigate it, etc. And the main piece that says how great this thing is, which is the Epic Controller. Mmm, it's got that new hardware smell. Been a while since I've used an Xbox controller, but I'm still quite familiar with the buttons. Let's see what else we got here. Ah, they give you some batteries to start off with. And the battery size for this particular, excuse me, this particular controller is... It says it's a 1.5 volt which would indicate that this would be a double-A battery that you would end up putting into your controller. So you put two of those in the back. As you can see, you're supposed to slip this up. Let me get this up and open. It also has a little charge port so you can actually so you can actually get one of those little uh, charge packs attach it to the back and then just plug it in it's also got a little charge thingy uh, not charge thingy but a thing in the front here to be able to hook up a uh, little keypad text keypad a little microphone jack for you to put in your headset. Having a bit of a difficult time with actually getting this stupid thing to pop off. There we go. I had to put a little bit of pressure on the back there. No, it's not broken or damaged. So we'll set this right here. And then we'll put this lovely little limey in here. Going up with this. And that's how you install your batteries for the people who don't know how to do so. And then you click it back on. See? Simple as that. Now we're going to hook up this bad boy and then there will be a part two to this video. So stay tuned ladies and gents and non-binaries non alike. Blech. Excuse me on that. I am going to properly put this stuff back into here so none of it you know, goes missing or anything like that. And I will be doing up a test drive of this once I get it all hooked up. 
and then there will be a part two to this video as I straight up stated before this is just part one the unboxing and then I will give my honest opinion on how great or terrible this particular system is and state as to whether or not if I do or do not recommend you to actually pick one up I mean you know you are free to do whatever you please it's just usually people would like to actually know what the product is like before they actually go out and buy it so yeah I shall close up the box Again, this is a 512 gigabyte SSD, and this is an Xbox Series S, and it is the Fortnite edition. So, I will... do it up and tell you guys how it went. by doing up a secondary video. So, as it stands, for now, as you can see, that's the box. That's the outer sleeve of that. Just set over like that. That's the Xbox Series S. It is very small. HDMI cable, power cable, Xbox controller. This, does appear nice, but we will see how she plays. So, for now, this has been Rainbow Heart. Sending out, y'all. Do not forget to hit smash that like and subscribe button for more updated content. Don't forget to turn on your con your uh, notifications, excuse me, to know when the content is uploaded. And stay safe, comfortable, and hydrated. Know that you're always loved, and... Yeah, you're going to want to smash that like and subscribe button to actually know the part two to this. Alright. Peace.